all right everyone hello and welcome to a brand new stream of russian fishing 4 i just had lunch <clears throat> so i apologize if i'm clearing my throat uh, because that's what's ha that's what happens after uh, eating a little bit <laughs> and starting to record a video or a stream thank you everyone for tuning in loaded ramen uh, bistro uh fully loaded happy birthday once again uh good to see you all happy and enjoying at that sunday uh cake wasn't good don't want to poison me well thank you for being so considerate and that's too bad <laughs> i just do birthdays for the cakes i really don't care whose birthday it is even if it is mine i just i just want cake that's it <laughs> uh favorite cake what is your favorite cake mine is hazelnut cheesecake oh my god it is so good i love it uh we are fortunate enough to have cheesecake factory in toronto uh so in us whenever i'm in florida visiting family we go to cheesecake factory you know maybe once but it's very far away and i love their hazelnut cheesecake uh guys today uh, i'm not at donuts <clears throat> I am at uh, uh, October and I am aiming for Loach, Sticklebacks, uh, Eastern, Breams, maybe even Sterlitz and then we will do a repeat of yesterday at Tunguska for Brown Trouts. We have a Loach, uh, unfortunately a non-marker. We're going to get a lot of non-marker fish here. Uh, but it's the hunt for that trophy. And we're going to get a lot of gibbles as well. How is, uh, how's your Sunday going everyone? Okie dokie, how many breams do I have? I have loads of bream mix. Perfect. Uh, let me just pollute the water a little bit by throwing in some ground bait. One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three, four, five, six. Bistro, those are nine fish. Uh, those are nice fish to target. Don't know when I will make myself go for those trophies. I know, right, Bistro? Uh, a hunter, hey, how's it going? I am going for s a small southern sticklebacks. Uh, loach. And uh, during the night, it's too late now, but during the uh, incoming night after this one, we were going to aim for Eastern Breams. There is a nice spot. It is right here. So you can get a few good marker Eastern Breams. And the reason I'm going for Eastern Breams is not for money, because we're not going to make much money. But they're helping me level up my bottom skill. Uh, where are my skills? I am... 79.2% in skill. I need to be 80% in order to get the spod rod. I believe that's going to change my life in this game. I hope so. Uh, we, we may aim for Sterlitz for a little bit. Then we're going to go to Tunguska and we're going to do a repeat of yesterday. Hunt for Brown Trout Trophy. It is, as you can see, really nice weather. 10, 11, 12, 8 is obviously ideal, but that's 3 hours later. I don't know if we will be there then but i think 12 degrees is what we're going to be there for <clears throat> bistro you had so much fun when you were level 28 the area and pond were active for eastern brain sadly i don't think they're active anymore at least at the pond i don't know if they've been nerfed or what and our very first devil fish look at that it has horns or spikes uh such a weird looking fish but you know what very cool its fins are all at the back it doesn't have anything on the top only two fins on the side 
Uh, very interesting. Look at its eyes too. It's like the eyes are infected as well. <laughs> so. Some nice silver, man. I miss. I miss the bream farm at Oldberg. Wow, Shivaro. Goofy fish, broad whitefish. Damn. Loach. Yes, another loach. These loach look really good too. I just wish they were markers. Uh, so I'm just doing a light episode, I guess, for the start. You know, we're not aiming for anything big. We're not aiming for big expensive fish. So starting off a little slow chilled out. Oh, I picked up too early. We do have a fish on. Or we did. Oh, that's annoying. Broad white fish. How do you even catch them? Is that live bait stuff? Broad. Broad. What? Broad white. Oh, Lord Tunguska. <gasps> Paddis fly. Ooh. Wow, very nice. Uh, another loach. So nighttime loach are very active. <clears throat> Sticklebacks are active in the daytime. At daytime, sorry. Hi Jessica, how are you? How's it going? We are at Octuba. Aiming for sticklebacks, loaches, and not this night, but next in game night, I'm gonna go hunt for Eastern Breams. There is an active spa right now. Uh, and the Eastern Breams mainly to level up my bottom fishing skill. So, uh, <clears throat> we have one stickleback. Unfortunately, not a marker. It's so hard to get these fish as markers. They're just so rare, I guess. It, this loach looks sort of chocolatey. I don't know, it looks yummy. Very colorful, nice pattern. Very interesting looking thing here. Alright, I just keep going into this and looking at the text. If it's spazzing, it means I have a fish on. Wow, there you go, Bistro. <laughs> I'm on Carp Trophy. Once I get the spot, I think I'm going to come to Amber then. <clears throat> oh, yes, I forgot. Tunguska. Uh, we might even go for that uh, Dragon Char. Now, I think it needs to be 9 degrees or lower for them, but we can try in the 11 degree weather as well. We'll try for maybe half hour and then we will go for the brown trouts. So just starting off a little slow, a little chilled out, you know, nothing too crazy here. <clears throat> and getting these shaffers through the shovel is so annoying. So annoying. I spent one hour. Digging, I just got one chaffer larva. Worms, of course. Hi, Beluga, how is it going? How has your weekend been so far? I see you sent me a lure. I'm assuming that is for uh, donuts. I'm not going to donuts today. I will hopefully go next weekend. I hope the weather is good next weekend, the entire week in game. Uh, cause today it's only good for one day. 20 degrees is good weather, but then we have 24 and 25, so that's just too much tight of a window. Now I have a hundred of those, <laughs> I don't need them. What do you use them for? 
like any specific thing. Handmade Moscow number two. Crafting lures. Oh, okay, okay. So you're just grinding it out and uh, you made this. Cool. I think these handmade lures, they'll eventually come in use for pikes, mainly. Wow, it lagged out there. Okay, I see. So once again, uh, we have a few loach and a stickleback. Uh, the stickleback, I was here yesterday, last night, and you will average one marker per half hour. Uh, the loach are even more rare to get a marker. So let's see what the heck we can get. I don't know if I'll even get a trophy. I'm not even having any hopes. I'm just here, you know, they're new fish for me, so why not fish for it on stream? Uh, you see the foam rubber? It's really good for char. Foam rubber, you say? Foam rubber fish. Ah, that's cool. Yeah, I guess I gotta grind this stuff out, but honestly, it's very low on my priority list. I need to save money for two barracuda rods so I can hopefully do a stream and an episode hunting catfish. Hi Jan, how is it going? How is your weekend so far? I know it's not- way. there we go! We got a larva. Finally. <clears throat> come on, come on. What the heck is this? Oh, nice! We got a marker southern stickleback. That is a nice start. I am so happy. Look at this devil fish. Uh, Jan, I am going to fish for e Breams tomorrow evening in game. It's too late now to travel to the spot. Uh, the spot is all the way over on this island here. So to get to it takes several minutes. So I'm going to do it uh, tomorrow evening. So the day we're going to spend here. Hopefully get a marker loach. We already have a marker stickleback. I'm so happy. I think that's our goal for today. Get a marker stickleback and get a marker loach. And I will be happy with this spot. Uh, stickleback are full, o uh, full over Europe. But a little hard to catch. Such an interesting looking fish. I remember this spot got two trophies there last time I was active. Wow. <laughs> Jazz, you're so good with this stuff. <laughs> uh, Jan, you've got trophy at the pond. You know, so many people are saying pond is amazing, or at least was amazing. Uh, but I don't know if the pond is still active, and I think people are float fishing for this. Uh, I had two bottom setups yesterday and one float. I did not catch anything on the float. Uh, so I just gave up on the float. I'm just doing bottom here. We're getting decent fish. Uh, but Jess, it's good. You got trophies here. It's uh, it's reassuring. That we have a chance, a slight chance. I just wish we could make ground bait. Um, I even... Lo oh, look. Did you see the waves there? I think that's just... From whatever. Not on float on bottom. Okay. Uh, but I don't want big heads though. I mean, our I'm using a 3.2 kg liter. So no big fish. <laughs> Another stickleback, a small one though. Uh, how big is our stickle? 30. I think 32 is my... Uh, <clears throat> my biggest stickle. Southern, a small 34 grams. I think 50 grams or something is a trophy, so we have a long way to go. Look at this, guys. At uh, Leduga, I was there repairing my Tagara, and I got this guy. Three spined stickleback. Another variant of the stickle. That one is brown, and this one is algae. I guess these guys love living at the surface right by the duckweed and algae. It's so cool. 
I know nothing about the fish, but I can uh, like figure out information just from its colors and stuff. And here's the southern. Julio. No fish yet. Are stickable? No, they're not good silver at all. Uh, the reason being, uh, just as you might have guessed, these are small fish. So you're not going to get any money. Just like uh, roach, basically. But so tomorrow evening we will go Ebrim. And Ebrim will be fun. I'm hoping to at least level up 0.01% for bottom. I'm at 79.2. I can taste the spod. Taste it 80%. Uh, three spined stickleback are full for Europe. Okay, I see. Wow, that's so cool, these tiny little fish. Yeah, thank you for tuning in, everyone. Please don't forget to like the stream. I hope today will be a, a fun stream. This is the slow part of the stream, I'm going to say right now. Uh, because we are aiming for the smaller fish and they're not going to be markers. But I just wanted to start off <gasps> another two. Yes. Oh, man. Finally, some good RNG on my side. Three chaffers we just caught. Uh, but I just didn't want to go for something too much or too intense. I just wanted to start off cool because I discovered all of this yesterday. I asked chat around because people were fishing for these guys. So I'm so happy I'm being a part of it and trying something new. Uh, tomorrow is Monday. I will be streaming the Fisher online at Tuesday, guys. I will be fishing, uh, fishing a sim world, uh, bass pro shop edition. I think I might have a gibble or a roach. Because it seems... Oh, no, it's a loach. It's a 62 gram loach. Hot damn, guys. Finally. Already I have uh, achieved my goal of the... Of a tuba. Uh, to get a marker, a loach, and a stickleback. There you go. This chocolate... Looking like fish. Cool. Cool, cool, cool. Uh, let's see loach. I think loach will be the exact same thing here for the weeklies. Loach, loachy, loachy, and there you go. Add a fly. Uh, the only unknown is what hook size were these guys using. Everyone is using size 20 to 22. That's what I've been suggested. Uh, so I did a size 16, but I only got a bigger. Oh God, I have size 4 on this. Let's not do that. Uh, loaded. No, these fish bite throughout the day. Uh, at night time, I've noticed loach bite more. And sticklebacks bite more during the day. But look at that. At In the evening, I've got a marker, stickleback, and a loach together. Uh, so there we go. Let's go with size 22. Add a fly. Hope that helps. What do we have? Another loach? Another marker. Oh my god, yes. Keep it coming, Papa Loach. Boom. Hello, hello. Oh my god. You have been farming these uh <laughs> lures. Thank you, Beluga. Is there a reason uh you are grinding uh the lures? Like, are you aiming for a special fish that only bites or bites good on a specific lure here? Yep, we have a fish on. Another loach. Not a marker, but good enough. <laughs> Pretty darn good. I am super happy with that. 
Uh, Stellar Sturgeon. Wow, so many different colors. Yeah, I hope you uh, heard me below, guys. Is there any reason why you're farming these or making these? Like, is there a specific fish you're going for? Uh, let's check the dragon that char. I'm gonna uh, guys. I'm just gonna call it dragon char, okay? Dry again or dry gin or dry gin. It's uh, it's not <laughs> no. <laughs> uh, dragon. Ooh, look at that. So today someone got it on West Siberian KB KGB. Got many bellows today. Six KG two. Oh hi, Carolee. How's it going? Bellora Bitsa, that is on Life Perch, isn't it? Yeah, that is out of my league right now, so I won't be able to go for that. West Siberian KGB is the lure we need. Do you have West KGB? No. But thank you so much, uh, Beluga, for these handmade lures. Hopefully someday on weeklies, people will be catching it, trophies of a certain fish. And uh, I will, I will go there. I will, sorry, use the lure. Uh, got many bellows on bleak. <clears throat> okay, that is out of my league once again. Because, uh, bottom fishing use of bait fish is at an 85%. So I cannot use them. I also need to make river mussels at bait. That is out again. I have to spend money. And I'm just not going to do that. I need rods right now. Ooh, another loach. Oh my god, yes! We are doing so well today, guys. Three marker loach already. That's insane. Let me look at the weather here. 34, 35, 29. I mean, it's it's the same weather as yesterday when I was here. Uh, farming a bleak took four hours and fished for an hour. Wow. Two hours, 13 Siberian sterlets loaded. Where the heck are you? Oh, at Tunguska, right? I'm so jealous. You have spot rod? Damn. And so many hours there and just heartbreak or heartbreak. Loaded, uh, when I go to Tunguska, I'm going to ask you for the location if you don't mind. And then hopefully you can share that with us and we can go ahead and try. Uh, do you want to read the name? Sorry, name for what? <clears throat> Oh, ground bait? Uh, it's gonna be tough to find yours. Cause I got a f where are they? Ground bait. Oh my god, what is this? I cannot read that. Uh, let me push my face against the screen and try. No, I'm sorry, I cannot read that. That's way too small. Yeah, I have, but don't use it here. Uh, there's a chub. That's a very first chub I've ever caught here. Two hours, 13 sterlets. Uh, that's a decent number. You know what? I was at one spot. I got three sterlets within like half hour. But then I came there again and spent like an hour and got absolutely nothing. Oh, we have a fish on. I don't know which rod though. That's the issue here. Ah, the sticklebacks are back. Oh, we can dig as well. Okay. Uh, Beluga, I'll just read your message. Give me a second. Okie dokie. Uh, oh, sorry. It's fully loaded. Thank you. 
13988 for Siberian Cyber Sterlet, uh, Cockshaft for Lover, and Nightcrawler. Perfect. Oh, we got a fish on. Oh, God. This is a gibble or a very big roach. That is a very big roach. One kg roach. Wow, look at his bloodshot eyes. You need some sleep, my dude. And... 6 kg was bigger. Oh, they were under 2 oh, Wow, 6 kg is insane. Man, okay guys, we have so much to do at Tunguska today. Uh, there's Dragon Char we need to go for. Uh, there's Sterlets. We'll just maybe spend half hour for Sterlets because it is very slow. Uh, there's Brown Trout. We'll leave Brown Trout for the end. If we don't have time, we will skip Brown Trouts because we did that yesterday. But today's better weather. I'm hoping we all have better luck with Browns. Uh, Jen, I was catching big heads and buffaloes on Caddisfly. That is trouble for me. And I already get trophy on the same spot 35 meter clip. Wow. That's amazing. Well done, Loaded. You guys have such good RNG, honestly. The only good RNG I've had is with this Russian sturgeon. I'm not going to kid around with you. Uh, I was gifted four pieces of rhinoceros beetle larva. I went to Aktuba here. Uh, I threw out within five minutes. I got a non-marker fish on rhinoceros and I'm like, oh my god, why? And I think five, like 15 minutes later, I got this trophy. That's how insane this RNG was. <laughs> and then after that, I spent so many hours and got nothing. So it's a one-time deal for me. I'm happy. I have a trophy. Oh wow, another marker loach. We are killing it with these loach today. I'm so happy. Pickle. Oh my god, yes! Another marker. We are killing it. Oh, I'm so happy I'm doing so well on stream today, guys. Uh, do you want... If you have the chaffer, sure. Uh, Jen, I'm assuming you're using like size one hooks and heavy setups, and then you're farming for them with caddisfly. But I wonder, like, if you're catching them, you know, like one a minute, or if it's a good farm. Oh, I'm just using trash ground bait like uh i was leveling up my ground bait and i was just using base and attractants these are 10 out of 10 quality so i'm just throwing them to get rid of them because i was so cheap i never threw them away <laughs> <laughs> and there is no ground bait oh my god yes another one uh there is no ground bait for stickles or for uh for loach i actually went to the shop and i'm like you know what can i get caddis fly ground bait attractants or anything and there is nothing so this is just whatever it's not this ground bait does not affect anything basically okay <laughs> Alright, Beluga. Uh, I hope you get some nice sized sturgeons on the three shafters that you do have. Uh, because what kills me is at Tangaska, all the weeklies for sterlets and sturgeons are on shaffer larva. And I have that. Uh, it's just that all the spots are extremely slow. 
Uh, Jan, I got a 72 gram off tro- Oh, you were 72 grams off the pink mark. Oh no. 20 grams away. Yeah, I- <laughs> I know this is nothing in comparison to your almost blue trophies, but uh, you guys remember on stream, what was it? I think it was this gibble that was 0.2 grams off a blue marker. So that was pretty sad. My very first blue trophy would have been this thing. But your pink salmon is just next level. 28 gram, we were almost there for a marker. <laughs> you have tons of air from 50 grams away of trophy. Oh yeah, we can dig. Remind me if I forget to dig. When my energy is up. Oh my god, yes, the larva. Wow, what is going on today? My RNG is through the roof. I'm getting chaffer larva. I'm getting markers. Yesterday... I spent like, what, three hours and I was getting one marker stickleback per half hour. And look at that, it's been half hour and we already have so many. Let's keep these positive vibes going. <laughs> Another one. <laughs> uh, do you guys think I have a chance of a trophy stickle today? Because I'm getting so many markers. Uh, Jan, I got 50 grams off trophy Shimaya two weeks ago. Wow. Loaded, you just ran out of Shaffer Larva. That sucks. Yeah, I had 40 larvas and then all of a sudden they started going down and I'm back to 38 again from 30. So I'm happy today I got a few. Uh, but I think the best way to farm digging for these guys is to go to Laduga. Uh, at the cafe, there is a fireplace and you can uh, stand beside that and keep on uh, keep on grinding and not worry about energy. Uh, another 1.9 kg. Fully loaded. You're on fire. Siberian Starlet. Uh, apparently, where are a bleak for a bait fish? I am sorry, I have no idea. Winding a rivulet. I remember going there, if you guys remember, on like two week ago stream. And I think I got a few non-marker leaks. Uh, rough. 46 grams. I'm downloading the game right now. Screen, hey, how's it going? Which game are you talking about? Russian Fishing 4? Uh, have you played this game before? Once again, uh, guys, tomorrow is the Fisher Online stream. I'm looking forward to that because we are in a beautiful part of the map. And uh, Tuesday... Day after tomorrow, I'll be streaming, uh, what is it? Uh, Fishing Semworld Bass Pro Shops game. I will be streaming that. And as long as my game doesn't crash, which it already has once, uh, I think it should be fun. I'm enjoying that game. The only reason I'm a little hesitant of streaming again is because, you know, the game crashing. Grin, I really hope you enjoy this game. Russian Fishing for all the best to you. Remember, uh, a lot of amazing members in stream chat right now. And you can join our channel. It's M Dog Gaming. M D A W G Gaming. One word. Join that channel. Whatever questions you have, I'm very sure someone will answer. And if I have that knowledge, I will do my best to answer. Uh, that's what the chat did for me when I was new. Uh, I had so many questions and people answered. Oh, thank you so much. Friend, I am a complete noob when it comes to fishing.
uh, but you know what, I'm still streaming and making videos from the perspective of a noob, basically. You know, when a guy discovers fishing, how does he react? What does he do? How does his journey look like? How does he grow? And that's what my goal is. I'm not here like M Dog. I'm not a pro. You know, he knows his stuff. That's what his videos do. Me, I'm just showing my adventure and I'm just enjoying my <laughs> the way along. Ooh, not a marker. I thought this would have been a fat one. All right, guys. Uh, remember, I hope I don't forget. Uh, but I think at like 1800 hours, we are going to make our way to the e bream electronic bream spot. And we're going to farm our bottom scale. I got to 82 to 90% in harvesting one happy hour. Wow. Damn, happy hour is insane. And it's... It's really sad how grindy they made it. They force you to buy a premium. So you have a chance of leveling up. That's just... That's a little too much. Okay, another stickleback. Look at this devil fish here. I haven't done this good at this spot. Look at that. 34 minutes. Uh, we have... 3, 4 marker loach. We have 1, 2, 3, 4 sticklebacks. That's really good. They said I couldn't catch 5 kg pike. And you did. Oh, you got your premium for free? What? Axe. Oh, it's a gibble. Gibbles and roach. Annoying. Uh, yeah, he caught a 3 kg pike. I said it's small. Sorry, what's going on? I'm lost now. Oh! <laughs> that is so funny. Nice one. So they basically challenged you. They're like, oh, uh... You catch. They told you to catch a 5 kg bream, and if you do, they'll buy you premium. And you actually did. And you know what? They actually honored that challenge. So good job on both sides. <laughs> okay, we have a fish. I don't know which one though. Fabric. Nice. 36 gram. Uh, who was it? You can mention their name here. And how did they even buy it for you? Because you cannot, like, give someone premium. Unless they, like, access your account. Okay, he's Lithuanian. Alright, that's cool. I don't know much people in this community, I'll be honest with you. A roach? At least it's a marker. You know, roach see, look so small, but 1kg roach is huge. I actually googled it yesterday. Because this game uh, does a bad job in showing the actual size of fish. Like, uh, let's see here. Like, see, this char is 1.3kg, right? And then you look at this catfish, it's 35kg. Yet they're the same size. Look at this minnow. It's bigger than both of these fish. Uh, in a literal sense. But then... Like, in real life, a 35 kg catfish is huge. It's a monster. So I actually have to Google some of these fish in order to get away of how big they really are. Ooh. 
Whoops. Okay, logged into your account. Cool. Better than a stickleback. No point in reference. Yeah. You know, uh, one thing I was just thinking about, you know, I really hope what they could have done is like a 1kg catfish. Maybe it should be a lot smaller, right? And a big one. Like a full, like a 100 kg one should be this big when you open, you know, the page for catfish. But let's say like 1 to 5 kg should be, you know, like this small. And as they get bigger, they get bigger on screen as well. I don't know. That's just like a suggestion. What happened in chat? Uh... Did someone get a trophy or something? I caught a 5 kg Bellarabitsa bits of whitefish on spinner. Wow. Nice work. I think Bellarabitsa bits are amazing money from what I hear. Close to 50 silver. Close to 50 silver for a 5 kg. Damn. That's amazing money. Nice work, Beluga. Do we have a fish on? I don't know which rod though. I have the lightest quiver tip, but even then these fish are so tiny. And look at how they're spazzing out already. I'm just so fed up with this. I don't think this used to happen before. I think this is uh, recent. Jan, you got your first 10 kg red star of a mirror. Wow, congratulations. Uh, that's some um, extremely rare fish and extremely cool looking fish because they are so rare. Nice work. Jovan, hey, how's it going? I'm here after a hard day of work and video editing. Ooh. Is the video editing for your like YouTube channel or is it for work? Uh, but thank you so much for taking out the time and joining my stream. I hope I do a good enough job to entertain you guys and, you know, stop you guys from getting bored. Uh, it is for my YouTube channel. Okay. Well, all the best to your YouTube channel. And that's really good. Uh, Jen, uh, just got to 80% bottom. Congratulations. I am hoping to get to 80% as well. That's why I'm going for Ebream today. Because uh, yesterday I was farming them. I only got a couple. And I actually leveled 0.1 or 0.2% in, uh, in bottom fishing. Thank you so much. Thank you so much, uh, Scrin. That's the entire point I'm here and I'm happy I'm doing my job right. You know, like I, I know I've mentioned this before, but I feel a lot of pressure when live streaming because like, you know how I'm farming for these fish. Now imagine for 15 minutes, I don't get anything. That's when I, I kind of get stressed out, like, come on, I need to catch fish. That's why on a stream, I might sound a little bit, um, what do you call it? Crap, I forgot the name. Uh, patient, yes, I'm very impatient on a stream. Uh, that's because, you know, like, I need, I, I want to catch fish. Uh, but off stream, I'll be, like, I would say two hours. And I did not catch this many markers, but for my video that I recorded, like you will see me catch these fish and the two hours will be like a 20 minute or a 15 minute video. Uh, so for videos, it's not a problem. Wow, really? All right, guys, 1.2 kg fluorocarbon leader and 24 hook. 
Uh, Joven, you are almost 90%. That is amazing. Uh, Carolee, I am a 53 at float. Well, yeah, you guys have been working hard on your, uh, on your specific skills. So we need a 1.2 kg float. Let's, let's do this, guys. All right. This KG Beller bit so 70 silver and 50,000 XP. Oh my god, that is insane. I wish you could just uh spin fish for these guys. But there's a reason why they're hard to catch because you need to do so many prerequisite things like life bait and stuff. Two kg leader and twenty-four kg hook. Uh, where are leaders? Uh, leader leaders. Fluorocarbon two point three kg. Ouch! How the hell do you get one kg? Two point two kg, nine point seven kg. Yeah, you got it on spinner. That's what I'm saying, uh, Beluga. That's very rare. I think the only way to make a 1kg leader is to buy a... Uh... Leader's leader material. Let's see here. 6.8, 9.2, 7, 9.2... No, what about lines? Fluorocarbon line here. Aha, there we go. One, oh my god, 50 silver? Are you serious? Thank you, Bistro. Wow, it's so expensive. Let's just go for the 1.2 kg. Oh no, we need swervels as well. Damn it. Uh... Accessories, swivel 2.4. Oh no. The smallest swivel is 2.4 kg. Uh, 2 kg liter. How did he get 1.2 kg? I don't know. Uh, These swivels are big. 2.4 kg is the minimum. So how did he get a 1.4 kg? I want to play Left 4 Dead 2 on our server. Ah. Uh, can get 1.2 kg because line is the weakest. Okay. So the swivel doesn't matter. Let's quickly craft these. Thank you so much. Uh, feeder, let's go 60 centimeters. Thank you so much, Bistro, for that. Uh, where is our line here? Uh, Joan, uh, let me think over it, if that's cool with you. I'm not sure how that will tie in with my channel. I kind of don't want to go for shooters and, you know, somewhat violent games, but I have a feeling I'm eventually going to cross that line someday. What am I looking for? 1.2 kg line. Where is this 1.2 kg line? Oh! Sorry, you don't even need to uh, make them. You can just put them on your rod. I'm so... Okay, got it. Uh, where is the swivel? Let me return that. Okay, let me buy three of these then. No, that'll be too expensive. That'll be 150 silver. I mean, I'll do it, but... I can't find the line for some reason.
I think that 1.2 meter line is not long enough, perhaps. Let's do, uh, let's do 10 centimeters and see if that comes up then. Oh, there we go. That's 1.2. Let's go for 60 and see. Oh, there it is. I was so blind this whole time. And then 6.8 kg. 18 kg. Uh, let's get rid of this 9 kg liter because why not? No. Sorry, guys. Give me a second. 2.4 kg. Okay. Let's quickly make these liters here. Feeder liter 60 centimeters. Uh, 2.4 kg. One, two, three. And then let's buy 24 size hook. Uh, hooks. I really don't know which one to go for. Classic, I guess, makes sense. Uh, 2018, 2024. Oh, how many do I have? I have three pieces. Perfect. Okay. Not enough energy. Sweet. Perfect. Of course. Uh, sorry. I can return one of that lines. Because there's no point keeping it. Uh, 11 kg, 1.2 kg. Yes, you are a $50 line. As good as, hey, how's it going? So good to see you. Yeah, the bar bar uh, the pizza. A whitefish, I can't imagine how expensive a trophy would be. Gibble, get out of here. Let's put 1.2 kg and size 24. Add his fly. All right. Trophy, come to me. 800 silver, that's it? That's disappointing. A loach. Uh, because I know a Caspian brown trout is worth over 3,000 silver at the cafe. Yeah, that's insane. 1.222. If the Bellarobitsa is a very expensive fish, I really thought it would be worth a lot more. At the cafe in the fish market, it's less than that. Oh yeah, in the fish market, it's less, but at the cafe, I was just talking about at the cafe. Okay, so Carolee, probably it's 800 silver for a trophy. But at the cafe, maybe it's worth more than 3,000. Oh god. Let's reduce the break here. Let's reduce the break to 8. Alright. Mr. How much percent you got in harvesting baits? Uh, let's see here. Scales. Harvesting, I'm 91.6%. So I can only get a uh, chaffer larva. I cannot get crickets. We need a rhinoceros. And that beetle larva. The mole crickets, sorry. Mole crickets and a rhinoceros larva. Is what I want. But uh, right now, at Octuba, what's working is river mussel. And at Tunguska... My regular, you know, rhinoceros, uh, sorry, croc shaffer larva is working, so. Oh, oh, thank you so much, uh, Jess, for reminding us, reminding me. Damn it, I just changed the hooks. Sorry, not on this guy. To size 24 and 1.2 kg liters, this is what's going to save us. This is what's going to get us a trophy. Unfortunately, not going to happen. 
let's go ahead and put 6.8 let's put bream mix where are my bream mix here bream mix let's put size two hooks let's put garlic dough okay uh the clip wait for ebream where are you 17 to 18 meters yeah, it takes a few minutes to get there. Thank you, Jess. That's what I said. Uh, we gotta leave early. Alright, what do we have here? Oh, come on. That was so stupid. We had a fish on. Oh, boy. Alright, Bream. Uh, bream mix, bream mix, 36 pieces. Eight. Size two. Garlic dough. Eight. All right, we gotta, we gotta go. Uh, let me remove this. Let me remove this. So it's unassembled and I just don't forget and throw it. How much spell you spend at leveling it up? Uh, I spent full two weeks of farming at Tunguska. All of the money I made went straight into leveling up ground bait from 35% to 90%. I don't know how much it costed. Maybe 8,000 silver, maybe 10,000 silver. I, I really don't know. I never kept count. So that's the reason it took me so long to finally buy my second Tagara, which I did a few days ago. All right, Eastern Bream. Wow, Fabric, he is doing amazing. Uh, we are 100% coming back. I'm trying out those 1.2 kg liters because I think we have a good chance of getting a trophy. Iftab, hey, how's it going? So good to see you. How is your weekend going so far? We are right. We are right now traveling uh, towards the eastern Bream spot at Aktuba. And I'm hoping to level up my bottom fishing uh, percent. I'm at 79.2% I believe. I need to get to 80 for spod. So I'm not going to bother with sterlets here. good no complaints pretty good weekend it's uh, it's 20 degrees outside and it will be for the next few days 
uh, very, very warm. It's not supposed to be this warm here in uh, Toronto, Canada. But here we are. So enjoying a few days of warm weather, unseasonably warm weather. Welcome everyone to the stream. Please don't forget to like the stream if you are enjoying it, which I hope you are. And uh, yeah, electronic breams is what we're going for, e-bream. Alrighty. This is the spot, right? 74... 85... 82? I think so. Those e are a little slow even with PBA. Yes, they are. Uh, but they were very decent last night. Oh, what the heck happened here? I guess I, uh... This is the unassembled one. Okay, 6.8. Size one, uh, garlic dough. I was here yesterday, so I know this spot. Oh, this spot works. Let's go with 15 here. Clip is 17 to 18. Bream, bream, bream. Three pieces, 12 pieces, 35 pieces. There we go. Okay. Eastern beam. Yes, Carly. I know, I know. I'm just messing around. Friction break, 16. Retrieval speed, 100 million percent. 18. Break, 18 percent. Looks like we have a bite. I'm gonna go ahead and throw some bream ground bait as well. We are at 17 meters bream mix. Uh, let's go ahead. Throw a 34 piece one. One, two, three, four, five, six. Perfect. 4450 Persian sturgeons are going on night crawler. Oh my god, you guys are just ah, you're killing me. Now I want to go for uh, sturgeons here. Three Persians now all on and night crawler, all small but markers. Ah, uh, I'm gonna skip for now, as much as I want to go there. Let's see if my spot works better than yours, mister. <laughs> Alright, let's see. I'm for Eastern Bream. Garlic. Everything is garlic, correct? Okay. Uh, I can't see your stream. My phone died. Oh boy. R.I.P. Okay. Alright, man. Uh, I hope it works for you, though. Put it on charge. I have the stream on my phone as well, and my, and my phone is right in front of me, and uh, I have it on charge. Because I know streaming just kills the phone batteries. I actually don't know any other Eastern Beam spots, because I've never farmed for any type of Beam. Ever since I leveled up and left Old Berg. So I didn't even know what size leaders we need for Beams, and people had to tell me. Come on, fishy, fishy. It's still 29 degrees. Six point seven to seven point four. Yeah, thank you. Yes, I'm using six point eight. That's the closest I have right now. Forty four fifty five is right down here. We can try. 20 sticklebacks. Look at that. Fabric is doing amazing with them. With the smaller leaders. So I'm just torn apart which way I need to go. All my trophies were on a hook. Large 4. 
Okay. I can put one size for hook and see. I mean, I have size twos and size one. Very first Eastern Beam. These look so cool. They look a little bit watery, like bluish. Size 4, unfortunately, is going to get us a lot of small fish, but... If it does give us the chance of getting a trophy, then why not? Uh, Carolee, you're going to try Tunguska all the best. You know which spots work. 113, 113, if you want a chance at a Brown Trout trophy. If you want money, 197, 197, 179 or whatever that spot is. And then Sterlets, uh, fully loaded, is already there. He's getting the Sterlets there, so if you... You have lots of options. Uh, Dragon Char could also be working because Tunguska is not too warm. It's 11 degrees, so you might have a better chance at them as well. So there's just so much to do at Tunguska right now. Uh, same thing with the tube. I've never really had so many things to try out at one time. Uh, there's Sterlet Spot that's working right now with Nightcrawlers. We finally redid our recipe for Sticklebacks. We're definitely coming back for Sticklebacks. Not anymore, Mr. I'm at too bad now for Ibrim. Oh. Last night, uh, I was getting nothing. I was getting small Eastern Beams and then all of a sudden I started getting one KGs. So it's really weird how they work. Global weekly record, 11 kg sterlet. Wow, I want a sterlet so bad. I want everything. <laughs> it's just too much all of a sudden. Do we have a fish on? No, we don't. This is the proton. Yeah. Oh. You guys remember the days? Dreams. I know you guys say Eastern Breams as well. They, like, you used to get so many in one night that you had to go back to town and sell them and then come back. About 600 silver in two hours, one minute at Tunga Scobit, Sturge, Sterlet, Burbit, Cats. Wow. You don't expect to make much money because it's so slow with Sterlets, but that's pretty good. One twenty four is catching fish. Okay, decent size. One kg, hopefully. Oh, that looks like a one kg. One point five kg stern bream. Julio. Bream, 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 bream. Uh, Jean. Okay, finally there. Keep it to 24. Here's a 1kg one as well. Nice. Nice. Tiny baby one here. Check if you still have my bream garlic. I think I do. Uh, white bream. Oh no, that's from uh, Bacillus. Is this right? Ground peas, bloodworm, maggots, fennel. Let's put this one. And then just... Muscle, eel, burbot, wild carp, barbel, uh, black carp, uh, 
Mm, I do not. No, yes, I don't. Ibrahim, I'm very good for bottom scale. Yes, that's why I came here because last night I gained 0.1% in one night, uh, which was pretty cool. And people were saying they leveled up too in their bottom. That's why I just had to come here again. There we go. It was bream mix with garlic pellets and garlic attractants. Thank you, Jess. I think I probably used it up because I can't find it. Uh, let me check my own bream mix. I think I can make bream mix, so I made a few. I have pearl barley, maggots, millet, porridge, anise oil. I think that's your regular uh, bream ground bait. Yeah, maggots, millet, porridge. Oops. Picked up the wrong rod here. White bream. Look at that. White bream is the one that has the bluish tinge, tinge to it. It looks really nice and clean. Hey, I got thousands of breams at Oldberg. I never got a trophy until I went to bear like a month or two ago and boom just so randomly i was in for tent and i got a brain trophy and us you're like yay 100 gram <laughs> uh blue you got a donuts oh my god okay i'm down there uh, Beluga, you got a donuts rough. Oh, sorry, not you, Al Alias. Yeah, the the leaderboards reset today, so that's why. But then Mister Fishing North Atlantic fixed most of the issues now. Yeah, I keep looking at their patch notes. <laughs> Finally fixed it. I, I want to go back, but just other games. <laughs> it's so tough. Gabriel, how is it going? It's been a very long time, Gabriel. I am doing good. How about yourself? How has life been for you? Oh, why did that take so long? Good. Tomorrow is school. Oh. All the best to you in school. 1kg. Ah, uh, so you've been busy with school, huh? Alright, look at that. We already have a few beams in 10 minutes. 7 beams in 7 minutes. And I think I'm doing very well today. Gabriel. Uh, you're going to school tomorrow, Miss Kudis. You have online school. That's not too bad. Oh, what a time. What a time. Interesting. Hello, Bream. Eastern Bream, another 1kg. Uh, I could really use a level up on the bottom scale. That's very good. I can play RF4. RF4 on one screen and school on the other screen. Perfect. Multitasking. Your eyes are going to become like a chameleons. When I look into the left, when I look into the right. Only online for 14 days. So I think you have alternating, right? One week or two weeks. No, I think it's one week online, one week uh, physically in class. I got 21 more days of online school. <laughs> Hummus. Yes, that's how you catch fish. 
Eastern Bream, but too small. Come on, level up. Oh, Tahina, I think he says. Wow, look at these tiny Breams here. So eight breams in nine minutes. I think that's pretty much all we're going to get. We're going to get a few more, but it's going to be a lot slower. Uh, but uh, we have a few 1kg ones. That's nice. I just need to level up. Uh, if you want to level up, go to Volkov and catch Atlantic Salmon. A lot of silver and XP. Ah... Uh, uh, no, I don't need to level up. I'm 31. I need to level up my bottom fishing. I'm at 79.2%. I need to be at 80 so I can start using Spod Rod. Yeah, that's the hard part. I'm in Tunguska. I've spent the last month in Tunguska. I've made so much money. It's insane. I'm not even trying and look at my spin fishing, 82.6%. I was at like 70 something percent, I think, before. Uh, so, yeah. <laughs> Thought I had to fish on. Alright, so uh, once it's morning, I'm going to stop with Eastern Beam. I'm going to go back to Stickles because we have our new leaders. And we should hopefully have a better chance at getting a trophy. At, at the same time, I want to try for Sterlitz as well. I don't know what to do, guys. Yeah, catch new fish. Yeah, Eastern Breams are new to me. I've never really caught them before. Randomly here and there, yes, but I've never farmed for them. Uh, you're going to Kurai. Kura is the same. 12 degrees every day and rain. If RNG has been good for you at Kura, then go for it. But for me, it won't be good. Sterlets are at 44.55. Uh, it is C8. It's this spot here. Into this deep hole. Uh, let me flip through my notes here what the clip is i could tell you uh 40 meter 38 to 40 meter clip and they're biting on night crawlers uh i think talinder i just said right now a few minutes ago that uh he was getting sterlets on night crawler sorry not sterlets he was getting uh persian sturgeons i believe Stellet. I don't know which type of sturgeon, but he was getting sturgeons on that crawler. One kg Eastern Bream, very nice. Still no level up though. Kura is terrible for me. Oh, are you gonna test your first wobbler? Cool. All the best. I'm very sure you're gonna do pretty good. Gabriel, yeah. Go for chores with Carolina Rig. So many different things to do. <laughs> hey, 0.1 person bottom fishing level up on a non marker fish. Yes. Oh my god, I am achieving all of my goals today, guys. I can't believe it. I wanted a marker loach, we got that, we got several. I wanted a marker stickleback, we got that, several of them. I wanted to go for eastern bream and catch, I know I didn't mention it, but at least one kg plus eastern bream and get a level up most of all. And we already have that. So there you go. Do we have a fish on? No. Super happy.
Let's see here by weight 1.5 kg. One, 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 one. Oh, that's a roach. Okay, cool. Turn beam. Uh, A, B, C, D, E. 1.595. So today is the biggest Eastern beam I've caught then. One point, oh no, 1.578. So yesterday was a, my biggest one. Very close today. I'll be right back. Try landing. Good luck. Thank you so much, Gabriel. For just uh, tuning in even for a second. See you soon. Hello, Brames. Why so quiet all of a sudden? Be here 19 hours. 19 hours. Okay, so these ground bit are gonna last us the entire night, so I don't need to worry. How much percent do I have in ground bait? Not a whole lot. 65%. That two weeks, I also leveled up my ground bait to 65% because then I could use uh, all the... all the things in making additives. I need to be 80 to 85% to use mixture and attractants for, you know, sturgeon, sterlet, and stuff like that. Uh, wild carps. That's super annoying. I'm not going to level up wow fully loaded 4.1 kg stern beam your spot's better wherever you are i don't even know where you are nice work All right, morning is coming up, so I think, uh, I don't know. Till 9 a.m., we will keep fishing, and then we will go back for sticklebacks. Stickerbacks. Stickler. Uh, I'm a bit down the river from your spot at the bend. Oh, yeah, this spot, too. Yeah, people are fishing this spot as well. This is very interesting spot nonetheless. What is this? That is a trophy roach. What? 1.252 kg trophy roach. <laughs> At least they should have given me a level up for a trophy. Like, come on. That was out of nowhere. <laughs> Thank you. Oh man, that's funny. Oh, I just threw this in. I just got a Lake Minnow Trophy. Wow. Oh, damn, Jan. Nice one. Thank you. Thank you, everyone. This is only padding up my trophy stats here. Trophies caught, carp rod, look at that, 30 trophies on carp rod, feeder rod, 21 trophies. And look at spinning, 11,000 fish caught, only 17 trophies. Uh, I don't know when the hell I got a trophy on telescopic rod. Oh, you know what, it could be a rough, maybe. Basic bottom fishing, 26, pop-up rig, 21. This is all, I think most of these are at amber.
Hello, fatty cakes. Okay, not too fat though. What's fabric catching? What did he catch? I don't even know. I can't even see his name anywhere. No idea, okay. Uh, Mr. What bait were you crafting to level up egg dough? Crafting egg dough. I still have 500 eggs and I have 430 pieces of salt. So I, I remember buying, I think, over 10,000 eggs, 10,000 wheat flour, and a package of salt. I have 400,000 eggs, uh, egg dough. So that's how much it took. Uh, I think the Bream are dead. I think it's time to go back to... Uh, it's time to go back to uh, Stickles for a little bit more. And then we can go to Tunguska. Dream not worth it. Two KG Lake Crowd. Okay, that's a start. I was at Kura yesterday, was I not? It was terrible. I got 8 KG and 3 KG and 2 KG fish. And I thought it was going to be decent, but I only made like what 80, 186 silver in one hour? That was terrible. All right, I'm just, uh, should I wait to get a fish or should I just reel it in? Let's just reel it in. Hello, Beluga. We just finished farming e -breams. And we're going after... Stickles again. Just for a little bit. Because now we have a new setup that I want to try. I really want to try for that Sterlet since we have the boat. But I guess I'm just going to teleport back. <laughs> Eat. Let 
Let me teleport quickly. Right back. All right, there we go. Let's quickly do this for maybe 15 minutes. Half hour maybe at the very most. And then we will go at Tunguski. At Tunguska we can try for Dragon Char, we can try for Sterlet. And we can try for Brown Trouts. Because the weather is, uh, it's good. Not amazing, but it's good. 11 degrees Celsius. No, I'm not going for Caspian. I'm going for Stickles. Now I have 1.2 kg leader. I hate how it just resets the clip. Really annoying. See, even this, everything got, just got reset. Man, these 1.2 kg leaders are very weak. I can snap them just by throwing these too hard. Alright. So far so good. Now if we get like a small gibble carp or a marker roach, we're going to be in trouble. And a marker loach. Great. Off to a good start. Okay. Stickle. <laughs> Come on, nickel back. And I'm calling them a sticker back. While we're at it, why not throw giblets out? Round bright. Oh, we can't throw it like this. Too far. One. Two, three, four, five, six. There we go. Uh, now, there is no specific ground bait to target stickles and loach, uh, but these are 10 out of 10 quality ground bait that I just decided to save when I was grinding it out. 133 silver from Electronic Bream. Very nice. You could make double that easily back in the day. I know, I know. Uh, but now these are the sad, <laughs> sad things. Do we have fish? Yes, we have fish. Please don't break the leader. 
16. Okay, we're still getting uh, non markers. 26 of them? What? I got nothing. 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9, 10, 11 markers. That's nuts. Okay, another stickle. Come on, come on. Maybe we should put size 22. Oops. 26 Eastern Brains. Damn. This is a big one. Nice. Look at that. 40 gram. This is now my biggest stickler. That is Coolio. Yeah, 50 fish. Uh, so sticklebacks in, I don't know, one and a half hours total. Less than that. In one and hour, 15 minutes, we have one, two, three, four, five. Damn, it looks like a gibble we have on. Yep. Okay, well, they're gonna be super annoying. Got my very first fish on a wobbler. <laughs> and Joe, and that's good. Hope you get something really good. Stickleback, non marker. One thirty nine eighty eight. Uh oh, it's uh I'm keeping the non markers, I really don't care. Usually I throw non markers out, but I just like these guys. I don't mind keeping them. You're going back to Lake Minnows now. All the best to you. Hopefully you get a trophy. <laughs> I don't know, these are new fish so I don't mind keeping them in my bag. Oh no. I picked it up too early. And a fish got away. How? Uh, we have a fish on. I don't know which rod though. No. Well, this is going to take some time. So let's just spend a little bit more time here, guys. And then we can go back to Tunguska. Uh, get Musk to translate. I don't think so. I think it's fine as long as it's friendly for the stream. That's all that matters. Oh <laughs> no, Muskus. Uh. I bought, I bought 500 pieces yesterday. I do not want to go back again. All right. Not a bad word. That's good. How big are you? 59 grams, guys. We just broke our record again. 50 gram was as big of us. Our biggest now we have a 59 gram one. Nice.
669 hours. Not a whole lot. Level 28. Hmm. Fish are active. That's good. Well, I hope you do good. Because I know yesterday and every other time I've done Kurai on a stream, people were like, yeah, it's doing really well. I'm getting Kurai chars left and right. You know, I'm getting Sivan Trouts. Like yesterday, people were getting Sivan Trouts left and right. I went there. I used the exact same setups that people did, and I did not get anything. So I give up on Kurai until it's very cold. And I see in the chat, you know, Kurai is coming out left and right. Only then will I go now. <laughs> a beast or stat padding leaving the game open and that's how you've got 1500 hours yes i am using the small leaders i'm using a 1.2 kg leader that's why i'm getting bigger and a bigger stickle oh you know what i need a tiny mesh let's Let's just get a 15 gram one. That's going to help us out. Uh, watch a live stream. There will be a giveaway. Not interested. Unless you guarantee every user to get something free, then sure. Okay. Who has a fish on? I don't know. This rod is jiggling, but... <laughs> I'm as good as you got school tomorrow. Try not to think about it too much. Thirty-eight gram. Wow. Let's just replace this. Twenty gram, huh? I mean, twenty is better than a forty gram. This should put less stress on our setup. Beluga frogs. Oh, nice. Thank you. Uh, bait. Oh, this is live bait. These frogs are going to go bad. Don't they go bad soon? These are live baits. Why did you give them to me? I don't have any use for them. Yeah, we can end it really fast when, uh, when you're not looking forward to school. No bait fish go bad. Oh, bait fish don't go bad. All right, I'm going to keep them. Until I hear people say, you know, frogs are working for Trophy Pikes at Laduga. Then I'll start, you know, going there. Frogs don't expire. Okay, that's good. Uh, they'll be infinitely in my pocket. Not frogs. Okay, that's good. Thank you, Luga. All right, we have frogs on now. They're ribbiting in my, uh, in my pocket. Ribbit, ribbit. All right, boys, we need, we need something good here. Look at that, 59 gram, 38 gram, 40 gram. So that liter size change made such a big difference. Before, uh, we were getting up to 31 grams, 35 gram. And that's it. And at nighttime, I feel like we're going to catch big loaches too now. Frogs are good for pike on Kurai. Okay. <laughs> you have 50 frogs. Uh, you have frog farm. Ooh. 
96. Oh, yes, guys. Our butter fishing went up. Yes. 0.2% it went up today, guys. I am so happy. And look at that. We are biggest loach yet. Man, we're, we're, we're doing good. We're doing really good. I'm just using trash ground bait. From my uh, pearl barley is all I'm using. <laughs> there is no specific ground bait for stickles or loach. Uh, but I'm just using ground bait just to get rid of my trash ground bait. Uh, Crucian carp. Oh my god, Crucian carp might work. For, uh, oh my god, I can't even think anymore. Uh, for Sturge. <gasps> where, where, where? Look at that, Baltic Sturgeon is on Shaffer. Halibut and Tuna. Oh. 84108. Someone got... Uh, sturgeon on halibut, tuna and halibut. So I'm going to try this out tonight off stream, of course. This looks like a gibble. What is this? It's a common roach. Crucian expires. Oh no. That's what I don't like about this. Even Perch is going to expire. No, not for Blue God. I'm not doing any of these guys. <laughs> Blue God, why? Why Blue God, why? Yeah, the Crucian and... The Crucian and the... Po oh, yeah. They're already expired. Blue God, stop giving me your trash. What are you doing? How can I get rid of this? Uh, discard. Discard. Alright. Stop giving me trash. <laughs> Alright, thank you, Miss Goodis. Uh, if anyone wants to donate river muscle bait, I will happily accept that. Because... Ooh, I can make bait fish? When did I unlock this? Whoa. When the hell did I unlock bait fish? I had no idea this was locked for me all this time. Could it be that when you gave me bait fish and frog, they just unlocked? Or am I just hallucinating right now? Uh, skills, harvesting bait. No, making ground bait. No, how do I... What? Baitfish unlock at 65%. Oh. I had no idea. Uh, just buy rate is lower. Okay. I mean, I'm definitely not going for belugas because they're trash money. Oh, you know what? No, no, no. Okay, here's the thing. I know I can make baitfish. But in bottom fishing, I cannot use baitfish. That's why I never cared. Uh, in spin fishing... Can you use bait fish in spin fishing? Uh, bait casting reel. So I can use bait on my spinner if I have it right. Let's go this. I got 66% in harvesting, but I won them from a giveaway. It's okay, Miss Goodis. Thank you for the warm thought. You don't need to worry. Yeah, bait bucket is... Oh, can... Uh, yeah, I can use uh, mussels. Yeah, 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 yeah. I can use mussels, though. That's so weird. I can use river mussel as bait, but I don't need live bait make scaling. Bait making skill. Or bait skill. It's so stupid. It, it's confusing. I'll, I'll be honest. Uh, because these guys aren't considered live bait. River mussel, for some reason, isn't considered live bait. Because I know, uh, Ma Mesk? Yeah, see, you, you gifted me one river mussel, and I ended up using it. 
I'm sorry, I did not get catch anything. I think I got some non-marker fish on it. Adactula, so sadly it did not work. But, thanks to you, I remember that I was able to use that rubber muscle, so I should... Oh no, I can't. Damn it, again, I cannot make river muscles. Oh, this is so annoying. One way or another. Okay, my bait isn't on this one. Eat my bait. Okay, let's throw this back again. Do I have anything on this? No, nothing yet. Waiting to get a fish. What gift? For what? Uh, you need 100% to make a river muscle and zero muscles. I need 5k knife to make them. Uh, money is not an, an issue for me. It's just, it's so stupid. Life bait, I can collect life bait, but I cannot use it. River muscle as bait, I can use it, but I cannot make it. Uh, everything, they've, they've, just, they've just thought of a way to screw you over. So I'm not spending any money leveling up my ground bait. I'm just going to use Cockshaffer for now. For being a nice person. Uh, you get a thumbs up for me. Hello guy, I think that is an awesome present. <laughs> Come on, stickles. We need that trophy. Oh, you gave M-Dog more stuff, huh? I see how it is. I think we have a fish on this guy. Yep. Trophy, come on trophy. No, non-marker. Damn it. Fully loaded. 44 gram one. Damn. Seems everyone's getting bigger fish than I am. 21 gram. Yesterday I had 138 gram zebra muscle, 2 grams away from trophy. Oh, so close. And so many of us are, you know, just so close to trophies and we don't get them. Or blue trophies for that matter. Like, uh, I remember on stream, this was so close. This was, this was such a heartbreak. 4.986. So close to a trophy. And then the other day I got an 8.3 kg burbot. And I think 9 kg or 8.8 .8 kg is a trophy. The genie fish, I call it. It's the first marker? Well, that's a very good sign, at least. Are you only giving ground bait? Okay, okay, fine. We're cool, we're cool. <laughs> oh. Oh no, come on. Almond Roach. My biggest, your biggest bird is 6 kg. 9 kg is a trophy. Okay, thank you. 6k. Uh, the burbot I got was, I think, on fish piece at Tunguska. I was fishing for a uh, night crawler. I was fishing for sturgeons and sterlets. And I just put night crawler on one of my rods because you had the chance at that spot of getting a burbot and a, uh, and an Amur catfish. And I ended up getting this big boy. That was pretty cool.
come on, come on. 35 degrees Celsius. That's pretty warm. I'm tired of the small fish. I'm going for sturge with my alphas. Good luck. Not only will it be a lot slower than this, but when you do get a fish, it's going to take you such a long fight for such a tiny fish. Uh, but when it's new for you, still enjoy it, so... I'm going to go to Tunguska really soon here. Oh, but we got a, got a roach or something here. Or a gibble. Why do they buy it on size 24s? Come on. Nice. Another bottom fishing level up, guys. This is amazing. 0.3% level up today. That is amazing. That's good. It's the only thing with bottom at Tunguska is sturgeon, sterlets. Ah, oh, lake minnow. A gibble. Basically sturge, yeah. Uh, Alex. I just tried fishing for pike with pretty good success and now there are 121 silver for 3kg. Oh, that order. Nice. Uh, Jan, which spot? Tell me the coordinates so I can look at my notes and tell you. Uh, your scale went up. Do you forgive the roach? Oh yeah, of course I forgive the roach. If I have a level up, like I got a level up on a non-marker fish and I'm still happy. No. Leave me alone, giblet. Roach. Oh, it's a marker giblet. Fine, whatever. Yeah, just uh, let me know which one. Uh, another roach. Are you talking about 4450? This spot right here? This one? I don't know which spot you're talking about. Uh, at that spot, at the bend, it is a 40 meter clip. Four zero. Yes, I'm good. Oh, I had nothing on this. Damn it. Yeah, so I think it was Talinder or someone in the chat. Uh, maybe half hour ago he was saying he, were, he was getting small sterlets or sturgeons, I think, on Nightcrawler. <laughs> Just jiggling the map around. Since it's going to be nighttime now, we have a chance of getting bigger loach. But at nighttime, a roach start biting us. Oh my god, a blue bream. I've never caught this fish before. Wow. What? Have I caught this before? Yeah, I've caught the bigger ones of this guy. Right? I think I've caught these guys before, but I've never seen it in this color. Wow. Interesting. Thank you, thank you, Beluga. If you get a blue, there uh, use algae or bark beetle larva. Yeah, you know, I, uh, blue and other types of fish are very rare in the spot. Uh, so there's no point targeting it here. Because yesterday I got a dace, so I put different uh, bait on for the dace and I still did not get another dace. Yeah, it's worth trying, but honestly I have no time right now. 
Love catching them at Wolkov. Okay, so this is my very first blue bream. Very interesting fish. So cool. <laughs> uh, do we have something on this guy? I think we do. Tiny stickle. Thank you, Jess. <laughs> that was so cool. My very first one. 52 gram southern stickleback. Nice. I think this might be my biggest one, or I think I have a 56 gram one. Uh, stickle by weight. 59 gram is our biggest. Uh, so with these 1.2 kg liters, uh, we definitely have a chance at a trophy loach and a trophy stickle. It just depends how much time are you willing to spend here. Uh, now I'm not going to spend much more time. I think evening time we should spend here because at Tunguska evening time is a bit slow. But uh, once the morning comes, we will head to Tunguska. And, uh, uh, Tunguska, should I go for Sterlitz at 84-108? I'm not sure. Or should we just straight go for, uh, Dragon Chars? Oh, wow, look at that, 8 degrees? Okay, guys, we are going for Dragon Chars right away. So tomorrow is going to be 8 degrees. I don't know if tomorrow it's going to be 12 degrees or 8 degrees. I'm not sure. It says today. Right? So today is about to end at midnight. So I'm assuming tomorrow is what it's going to be. 8 degrees. So I think it'll be the perfect time to try for Dragon Chars. This is probably a roach. Yeah. Damn it. Common roach. Wait, someone is going sturgeon farming? Look at that, someone just got a 3.9 kg dragon char. What spot are people talking about in the chat, guys? I wasn't following the entire discussion. Oh no. Oh no, what do we have here? That's a big fat roach. Nine hundred seventeen a gram. Oh, you gave me a scare. Eastern bream, white bream, and now we have blue bream. Twenty seven.
34 gram nice definitely a much better bite rate in terms of marker uh sticklebacks on a smaller leader let me just recast this Guys, please give me two minutes. I will be right back in two minutes. Let me just... Do we have a fish on this? Yeah, let me just reel this fish in. Then I'll be right back. Loach, uh, not a marker still, even with the smaller leaders. All right, I am back. Uh, where is 85125? 
uh, like right behind the town. E4 is where it's at. Thank you for the cafe order. I'll go right now and sell my stuff. 53 grabs. Nice. Man, Jolin, you're doing really well at Kurai. I got nothing. Where is this order? How long is this order for? Thank you everyone for tuning in. Please don't forget to like the stream if you're enjoying it, which I hope you are. Uh, bream, we don't have a single bream. Small stickler. 10 minute. Oh, no way. Nice. We just sold two non-markers for 10 silver. That is great. Uh, we have uh, nothing else. Let's get back here. Uh, clip, uh, 8, 7, or 8 meter is all you need. Size 24 hook. 1.2 kg liter. Lower carbon, of course. Loach. Okay, no difference on the loach, sadly. Uh, two 10 gram for 10 silver, or the rest for 11 silver. <laughs> oh, that's funny. Uh, I mean, honestly, these are not good money because they're small fish, but we're not here for that. We're here because they are new fished for us and it's an easy method of fishing them. And the other reason being uh, since it's a, it's the best spot you can get for now if you do want a trophy. Uh, I think uh, two more minutes and then we will go Tunguska and go for Dragon Chars. Do you think Grand Bay increases your bite rate? No. I don't think so. Because I don't have ground bait on this rod. I don't have ground bait on this rod. And I got like a 53 gram one on this guy. This one, I just have ground bait. And again, I'm just throwing in trash. Pearl barley. Do you really think any fish is going to have an increased chance of biting? Like, do you think the devs made this game so easy that you can just throw out pearl barley and you'll start getting fish? So I don't think... Ground bait. I know ground bait does not make a difference. Ten. Come on. Gibble. I'm here because I think I will get lose. Wow, very, uh, very positive thinking. All the best to you. <laughs> 17. Who knows, it's RNG. Maybe you'll get a blue tag, maybe you'll... Get a trophy, maybe you will get nothing. Or maybe you'll be one gram off of a trophy. Do you have in-game a chat? Uh, Alex, I do not, but I am a part of M Dog Gaming chat. And most of the viewers here, or at least some of the viewers here in the, in the chat and in the stream are from the M Dog Gaming channel. So we are all over here. 
if you want to come join us it's uh, everyone's welcome m d a w g gaming one word if you want to find us 957 members so far ooh 95 gram lochi loch let's get rid of this because this is very heavy 40 grams i'm pretty 20 grams that should ease up our load on the rods here on our leader sorry seems like most people are i used to be in that one yeah a lot of people are on it Finally, uh, loads. What's our biggest load so far? 96 gram is our biggest one. Then we got 95. And then 83, 68, 66, 62. And then stickles, 59 gram is our biggest. Alright, so it's uh, almost 2 a.m. in game time. Uh, how much longer till morning? I think if we head it out now, just getting set up and everything for the dragon charts, it will be morning time. Twenty-six grams. Yeah, you know what? Let's call it a day here. Twelve gram. Wow, all of our rods had something on. Damn. And we lost that. That's just... Urbit are biting like crazy. Wow. You're making that Kurai work. For you. <laughs> okay, let's see here. Can we at least make 50 silver to go to Tunguska? We actually made 10 silver already, so that's pretty good. Nothing else. So what I want to see is Eastern Breams. Uh, we spent 13 minutes and we made a 50 silver. Your sure thing. Oh, wow. Look at that, guys. Blue Bream, 341 gram is 23 silver. Wow. That's how you know that's a rare fish. Damn. Then we have the Trophy Loach, 10 Roach, sorry. Then we have Eastern Bream, 1.5 kg is 9 silver. That's a disappointment. How many Roach trophies worth more than Eastern Bream? Uh, then look at these Loach. Look how expensive they are, the bigger they get. 8 silver for 95 gram. And our sticklers are here as well. Uh, 188 silver in uh, 2 hours. So, yeah. Enough money to go to Angaska. Let's go there. Dragon chores, here we come. I'm hoping we can end the stream with a little bit of brown trout fishing. I really want to go sturlet slash sturgeon fishing at Tunguska, but that's going to be way too slow. I don't think I'm going to include it in the stream. Thank you everyone for tuning in. We are going to Tunguska. And get... And get ourselves some flame breathing dragon chars. <laughs> if you don't haven't already, uh, say hi in the chat. You're all friendly here, and uh, uh, don't forget to throw a like if you're enjoying the stream here. Uh, Fifty kg tame in. Three spine stickle. Nothing interesting. Ooh, Mascutus. 200 gram Siberian Starlet. Congratulations. Mascutus, what spot are you at? 84108. No, that is Aktuba. Anguska 8996. Or 73105. 136.89. Okay. Uh, I was using... Uh, Caddisfly. 
is what I was using. Uh, Ms. Kudis, thank you. Hung 138.89. Actually, you know what? Didn't Fully Loaded tell me that already? Yes, he did. Thank you. Uh, what is the clip? Did I ask for the clip? 139.88. Uh, 40 meters. Okay, perfect. Thank you. Forte Mertars. I got it. Well, a great beluga. Uh, whatever works. Redworm works in getting more of them. Then heck yeah, use that. Alright, let's get rid of these guys. Uh, let's put on our... Our... No. Dang it, I don't remember which rods I used. Alrighty, uh, just give me a second, guys. What was I doing? What rods did I have out right now? As hopper? What? Alright, this is a 6.5 kg rod. You are useless. I don't need you. Uh, you are 11 kg rod. Alright. I need 11 kg. Perfect. Real gold fishing line. 11 kg. Leader. Uh, crap. Guys, for the dragon chars, what leaders were we using? 13.8, I think. Or was it 6.8? I'll use 9 kg. And we were using Satori. Friction break. Retrieval is 16. Flip is off. Perfect. 11 kg. Real is alpha. I hope I was using. We're getting Eastern Breams, nice. And this is just Nightcrawler. What were we using? Were we using fish pieces? I don't remember. Alright, let's go for those chars. I don't know if I'm using the right sized leader. Siberian Char Loach, what? Where is Bistro? He is not at Amber. Ok. 
Okay, I hope this works here. Oh, come on, seriously? That was stupid. I really thought there was no clip. And of course, my ground bait just got used up. You're doing three rod drifting at Tunguska. Ooh, never that seen fish before. Siberian charlo. Oh yes, I know that fish. Okay, very nice size. Are you using the black handmade spoon? I've only ever got it on that, but if that's probably on Spiker, but good job. Nice. Good to see you somewhere else. <laughs> I guess no one knows what leader to use for dragon chars. Yeah, at Tunguska, hunting for sturgeons with a week reel is going to be much harder than at Oktuba. Uh, compared to Oktuba. Because Oktuba, it's a uh, tight river. Uh, so you can uh, run in front and you can uh, make it go against the bank. Uh, but at Tunguska, with a 50 meter clip, it has another 100 meters it can pull away from you. So it gets really hard. Alright, let's do this. Yeah, if you hook a Sturge, R.I.P. Come on, it's cold. We better get something here. There we go, we got something. Looks like a perch, probably. And this spot's super annoying. Because the fish gets stuck. There we go. All right, Perch. Disappoint me. Oh, that's an Arctic. And it's a marker. All right. So it's eight degrees today, guys. You cannot tell me that we are not going to get a char. Like we have to get a dragon. Oh, someone's already on it. Now, this is a 9 kg liter, so... That might have been a mistake. Because we're going to get spooled. Damn it, we're going to get spooled real fast. Maybe 9 kg is too small. Okay, finally. Probably a small fish. Come on, damn it. 2.6 kg pushed us that hard. I don't know Arctic's here at Pond or on a speed today, running like crazy. I just hope this 9 kg liter isn't too small. Because uh, we're going to get spooled real quick. We only have 120 meters of line. Let's get a better line here. Two hundred meters. Uh, 
200 and no i need 300 meters what can we get that will fit 96 whoops nope Yes, 345 meters of line. All right, that's good. Yeah, the Arctic's really running hard today, huh? It's cold weather, that's the only reason I came here. Because we have a better chance of catching dragon. I'm going to recast this guy. Uh, let me just get a longer line for ourselves here. 215 meters. I guess that's all I'm going to have to use then. Any day now. What's wrong with this lake? In hotter weather I've gotten more fish by now. This guy's right here. Yep. Uh, what do we have so far? Wow, six minutes, just two small arctic chars. What is going on? Even with the smaller leaders. Oh. Uh, guys, I'm... Oh, crap. What, uh, what gear am I supposed to use? Am I supposed to use lures? I think that's what I'm doing wrong. 
We're supposed to use Jig or something, right? Yeah, you know what? That's the mistake I made. No wonder. Oh, not jigging. Uh oh. Guys, are we using just a regular lure? And we're doing that jig step method? This feels wrong. Okay, lure rig, but I just do jig, okay, because it's just, it's not working. I'm not sure what's the issue here. I'm using 9 kg liters. Are these fluorocarbon? Yes, they are. And it's cold for once, and I'm not getting anything. Thank you, Jan. Finally got something tiny here. A purge or... Alright. Thanks, Jess. I don't know what's wrong. I waited the whole week. Finally the perfect temperature. If this sucks for a few more minutes, I'm just going to go for brown trouts and we can start a competition. Biggest brown trout wins. Twenty-five, okay. Great, we got something. Man, it's an Arctic. What the heck? 1.9 kg. Definitely 9 kg is the smallest I've ever got. I think I used to use 13.8 kg before. Alright, Mosquitoes, thank you so much for sticking around. Have a great night. Enjoy school, yeah. Tiny, tiny fish. I'm telling you, try right side of the lake. That's closer to the deep. All right. Uh, I've tried at the right side and didn't get much at all and I've caught many of them here so That's why I've just stuck around to this spot, but let's go to the right side And try there Alright, Jan. Thank you so much for being a part. Alright. I'm not even going to bother with this fish piece step. Jan, are you going to Tunguska or are you leaving? I think all the way from here? I think, yeah. Okay. 
Okay. Let's cast here. And let's cast there. Let these guys sink. Come on, fish. Fluorocarbon. Yeah, this is fail. I had high hopes with the cold temperature. We would get some luck. I've caught so many more fish on regular hot with days compared to today. I'm gonna try this once more and that's it. Then we're gonna go for brown trouts. 44.55 is... Oh man, you need to write down notes because I've mentioned it before. It's C8. You know what? Probably that's it. The lures changed since last weekend. I have size one. It's the same as last week. Uh, clip 38. Yeah, clip 38 to 40. People were having luck on 38. So. Uh, dragon. So, wow. Uh, what is today? Today's the 8th, right? Yeah. It just actually reset today. So, again, Satori 22 gram 009 that's the one we're using i don't know why that's not working we have a hunter here zero 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 three but i mean satori clearly is in the weeklies i'm using 25 real ends, and i've caught many dragon chars on 12 real in speed I don't know why all of a sudden it's just not working. So I'm not going to bother with this. It doesn't matter how much I change my technique or use different lures. I'm not going to get it. Thank you for the suggestion, Jess. Fortunately, it's not my day here. Not even marker pike. I always get 900 gram pikes here. Hmm. So let's go ahead, equip our 
6.8 kg. Put our spikers here. Perfect. Let's go ahead. 6.8 spiker. Perfect. Let's put clip to 80 here. We're gonna hold a competition for brown trout. Biggest weight wins. Uh, in, uh, in another like five minutes, let me just get set up and go over there. Maybe we will have better luck there, I hope. Really, really hoping. Uh, 15 kg. 6.5 kg. So this 15 kg we're gonna pick up. Alpha 15 kg, right? So we can have a 11 kg line. Hundred kg leader, and we will have our handmade spinner bait here. One ninety eight meters. Two fifteen. 345. Uh, blue guy, 250. Uh, you know what? It's 12 jig step worked for me, so why do I have to try all of these different ones all of a sudden? But it's okay. I, I give up on it. I might come back after stream and try it again. I'd Let's just see. <sighs> all right bistro uh i'm going 113 113 that's where i've got my trophy brown trouts and as you guys saw yesterday i got so many 1kg brown trouts so if uh if you want to you can go to whatever spot works for you but 113 113 is the best spot for me for brown trouts so if you are at tangaskar want to join the comp uh, that's where i will be thank you bistro once I get there, I'll uh, start making the competition. So the biggest brown trout wins. Yeah, Beaster, you've been camping at Amber for months. For a very long time. A good change of pace. Let's see here. One thirteen, one thirteen. Right, yeah. All right, let's uh, get this competition rolling. Uh, maximum weight of brown. Thank you, Bistro, for making it to the event. Uh, just hope we get at least two more members. It's better with a total of four people minimum. Oh, sorry about that. Uh, it's better with a minimum of four people. <laughs> uh, whoops. We need 24 hours. Uh, you can use float, you can use bottom, you can use spin, whatever you want. Perfect. Fully loaded, I, I know I've said it before, but you gotta post your setup on Discord. 
Because I want to see what's going on. Why are you not getting anything? Anyone else wants to join, please do so. I think I've started the competition a little late. That's why there's less people now. Uh, on the stream and perhaps maybe in the game or maybe they're just not in game today. Uh, just going to selfish to let you know when you're ready. Okay, perfect. I will wait. Let's just throw in one rod and see. Uh, once the competition starts, it resets the fish of the area, so we don't need to worry. It's only one hour. We're not going to fill up our net either. Ink. Linear, 7 kg rod, 6.4 kg liter, and spinner bait. 6.4 kg fluorocarbon liter, I have 60 centimeters, and the usual spiker. And on the spiker, you have size 2. Okay. And size two, right? Hook. Non fuzz hook. I just I think I have bridge treble. Okay. I mean what the heck? And you set a clip and you leave your bill open, right? I know it's obvious, but we need to make sure. <laughs> Starting from the simplest things. Okay. How do you not have any luck? I just don't understand. Well, no one does bad at the small streams. Okay, finally a brown trout. I'm doing all what I should, but that's life. Oh man. Sadly. Yeah, I guess that's me everywhere else, right? I've gone to Olkov, I've gone to Kurai, when people have been doing good and I've gotten nothing. Uh, so I guess this is the only place that works. And sadly, I think Beast was the only one who's going to join the comp today. No one else is uh, is interested, so... It's okay, one versus one is good enough. Unfortunately, it's becoming evening time, so it's going to be a little slow. Yeah, load it. Uh, no worries at all. You do whatever you want. I'm not going to force anyone. Beastra, as long as you have the same setup or similar setup, it shouldn't matter. It's all RNG, honestly. Just make sure you have a fluorocarbon 6.8 kg and the black spiker. And that's it. That's all there is. There is no PV. There is no ground bait. If I can do it, anyone can. And a pink salmon. Four thousand XP for a six hundred gram pink salmon. Amazing XP for these fish. Uh, the competition is already made, so whenever you want to join. Yeah. If you want me to, I think you, you probably know what setup you need. But if you want to know, you can 
I can post it for you or tell you once again. Simple stuff. All right, Bistro. Thank you for joining. All right, perfect. Uh, let me just reel this guy in. And then we can get started. All right, sir, competition. All, oh, wow, okay. Uh, all the best to you, Bistro. I have a feeling you're going to win. Uh, what's it going to do? Real troop speed here. My god, what? Oh, what? Crap. No. I messed up. That stupid bottom fishing rod I still have out. <laughs> oh, man. Alright, we're gonna quickly go ahead and retrieve that. Where the hell is that place? It's right over here. Yeah, I forgot that rod. That stupid lake area. What a letdown. Wait, is the competition on? Oh, I'm not in the competition chat. I'm just going to join the competition chat. So whenever Bistro gets a fish, I will see. <laughs> Head start. Yes. It's okay. We have like one full hour, so. Uh, even at nighttime, you have a chance of getting a big. Uh, Where is my rod? Oh, it's right here. There you go, 360 gram on trout already. Hopefully it doesn't get stuck on the rocks here. Guys, once again, a reminder, tomorrow the Fisher Online stream, uh, I just love that game. You know, it's just so relaxing, especially, I think I'm in Germany right now. There, and it is so relaxing, it's beautiful scenery, I can't wait to play that game. We're gonna catch some big carps over there. That's gonna be fun. And then, the day after tomorrow, which is a Tuesday, I'm gonna stream the new fishing game. Fishing a sim world uh, bass pro shop. So let's see how that game goes. Damn, fifty-eight gram you caught. Look at that spin fishing. I don't even care about spin fishing and my. Level goes up. 50 a gram, 360 gram, and now beast with 410. Okay, looks like something decent. It is cold, so fishing should be amazing. Man, Beastro is constantly getting them browns. And he's slowly going up too. <laughs> getting me worried over here, Beastro. Okay, 140. Alright, alright. Ha <laughs> ha. 
<laughs> uh, Bistro. I know, you and a few other people with PB, you guys catch common carp trophies like... They're just regular fish, like they don't have a meaning to you anymore, you catch them so often. Like one... One common carp trophy an hour, that's how common it is. So at least here it's a fair playing field. Like we have the same setup, it's not that you have PB and I don't. Or you have higher skill in, uh, you know... Another fishing setup. This is just basic fishing, basic spinner fishing, and we both have three of three points invested. So this is the most fair fight we can have. 637, finally. Yesterday was a slow day, but man, I got so many. I got five 1kg plus browns, so... Today, when it's cold, it should be explosive, I would say. Uh, Bistro, are you going to be in-game for, uh, like, many hours to come? Look at that, Bistro one-upping. Because after stream, I'm going to leave for dinner, I'm going to have some dinner, I'm going to spend some time off. And then once I come back, I'm going to start... <clears throat> I'm going to go for uh, Sterlets and Sturgeons here. I'm at the Sturge spot. Good luck. Good luck. I was there for a few hours. I got absolutely nothing. Uh, but fully loaded, I believe. No, fully loaded wasn't Tunguska. Someone else. I believe Talinder was there when I started the stream and he got a few on Nightcrawler. So you should be able to get a few on Nightcrawler today. We got something good sized here, guys. Please be a brown. Is Beaster in trouble? Is Beaster in trouble? No, it's a stupid pike. Beaster is fine. Uh, you got it on a Nightcrawler. <laughs> yeah, Jess. I don't even uh, do anything. I just stayed at Tunguska for two weeks and I shot through. Okay, perfect. That is a good technique. Uh, Beluga. <clears throat> so on my two bigger 26.5 kg Tagaras, I have the Shaffer Larva. And on my smaller Tagara, I have Nightcrawler. Oh no, you have work tomorrow morning. Okay. Well, thank you for taking part in the stream. You can leave whenever you want. I know it's uh, one full hour almost, the competition. If it's too much, just leave whenever. Uh, fully add Tunguska, 138, 89. You got <clears throat> Sterlets, excuse me, Sterlets. Uh, with a Nightcrawler at that spot. So I have Cockshafter and I have Nightcrawler. So I'm going to use both and see how it goes. Not that early. Okay. Thank you. Thank you, Bistro. Luga, good luck. On the Alphas or whatever it is. Going to be tough. But you know what? That 4450 spot is amazing. Because you can easily trap the fish in that uh, cul-de-sac or whatever you want to call it. That bend. That is a very prime spot. Even if the fish runs, there is so much river you can run on both sides that you cannot get spooled. Even if uh, you do it stupidly, like I did. I got something huge on at, uh, uh, uh sorry, uh, Aktuba, two, three days ago. It overheated my Tagara the entire 300 meters. It spooled me, uh, but it, it Overheated my reel the entire time and I had to alt F4 and I made the mistake of not running and trapping the fish. So even if that happens at 4450, that's by your at Beluga, uh, you should have plenty of time to run and uh, stop the fish.
Man, what is these non-marker grailings? Uh, crap. When did we start? Oh, I forgot when we started. But fishing not looking too great at Tunguska. Even at the river. Yesterday, I know all of us, all of us were doing okay. Not great. Uh, but still some really good fish I had. Uh, but who knows? Maybe it's just because it's evening time. Evening time, it's uh, less fish. Brown, so many non-marker brown. That's just sad. Uh, spinning, 82.7%. So the next level is at 90%. Uh, that looks like a pink. Oh, that's a brown. Nice. Okay, finally. Yeah, at night it is a slower bite rate. But yesterday I did get one or two 1kg browns at night. So even at night you have a chance of getting some good quality fish. Pike. I'm chopping you up Pike. You're coming in my way. That's a fat pike. We have a chunk this big come out of it. Oh, we already have a fish on. Oop. Uh, and a cat stole my gold bait. Only two left. R.I.P. Yes, there are big cats at that spot too. Uh, someone posted a screenshot on VK, I think, or maybe Discord, and they got like a 48 kg cat or something. Uh, so be wary of that. Right now I'm saving up for two barracuda rods so I can go catfishing at Aktuba. That is going to be a brand new experience and a scary one. Come on fish, come on. Uh, seven minutes ago I would say no. Nine minutes ago. Ooh. Okay. Decent quality fish here. Maybe I should just reduce the friction break to 18. 3.8 million XP. Yes, there we go. 1.1 kg brown. Finally. Blue go, what's up? Anaku, 2 kg eastern. A bream stole my gold bait. Thank you. Thank you, Bistro. Uh, Beluga, non-marker perch, and other garbage fish will eat up your ground bait. Uh, sorry, your, uh, your cock shaft for larva. I think I had... A non-marker rough eat my cockshaft for larva. Like, the larva is bigger than the non-marker rough, and that stupid thing managed to eat through it. So it's gonna it's gonna annoy you. Thank you once again, Bistro. Like I said, it's anyone's game at nighttime as well. On the official form, 113, 113 is the actual spot for active brown trouts. So I decided to check the spot out. You're not far behind actually. Back Tunguska. <laughs> I came to Tunguska trolling absolute trash. Trolling did not work for me. Uh, I tried the open rod me method and wow. 
I had 9 kg liters, I made 300 silver per hour, and then I downgraded to 6.8 after getting help, and man, that changed my life around. Ever since then, I've never moved. I know it's boring sometimes, but it's just so much fun. I have two Muxen trophies, I have two Perch trophies, I have a Brown Trout to trophy, I have a Rough trophy, and I think that's about it. I don't have a trophy brown yet, so it would be nice. Yeah, Beaster, I mean, it's only a matter of time. Or you get a brown. Surprisingly, I was here... My first day here, actually. I No, my second day here. Maybe my second hour in total, or maybe my third hour, I had a brown trout trophy. Never expected that. It did not even fight. It was so unexpected. I thought it would push our 6.8 kg leader and it did not. So I think as long as you stay at the spot, you have a good chance. And you guys saw yesterday on stream how many 1 kg brown trots I've caught. And even you, like uh, whoever comes there, Beastro as well, like we, we are all catching brown trots here. So I think... It's the best chances any to uh, to get a trophy. Oh, I got a trophy minnow as well. Yes. Minnow as well. I can't believe I forgot about that. Where is it? Is it a Siberian minnow? Is it a lake minnow? I, I forgot its name. Lake minnow. There we go. Trophy. Just like that. So these smaller rivers have been very bountiful to me. <laughs> so happy with that. Ooh. Oh, oh, oh. Oh no. Oh no. Please don't be a pike. Because uh, my leader went all the way to max. Because if it's a pike, I'm going to have to alt F4. Because it's going to bite through my leader. I've already lost two spikers that way. What are you? 2kg brown trout. Hot damn. Beast I'm sorry, but you're in trouble now. <laughs> I did not get a 2kg brown trout yesterday. And uh, I got one today. I, I'm, I'm sorry. <laughs> Beluga, I thought it was a pike because it was pushing our leader to the max so quickly. But it's a 2kg. You know what? I'm happy with that. Man, another brown trout trophy? Wow. That would be amazing. Fish got away. Damn it. Sorry, Bistro. Like I said, this is all about RNG. It doesn't matter. I'm not doing any special technique. I don't have any special lures. So it's all RNG. Uh, but the reason I love it here is because even if I lose comp the competition like I have been every day, you just make so much money that it, it's, it doesn't even matter. I'm still happy. Uh, brown Trouts. Look at that. Spiker 2 number 10 is working. I want to switch it up to 210. But I don't think I have 210. Spiker 18. Uh, the green lure sucks. It's never worked. These black ones are amazing. Brown trout 1.7. Wow, Bistro. That is a nice size too. Let's see if I have it to 10 and we can just experiment with that because that is on the leaderboard. Uh, Beluga, you're... I don't have a peelid, unfortunately. It was a muxin. And it was on uh, the 16 as well. Uh, Sadly, I do not have that spiker and I'm not going to run back for another one. So I'm not going to bother. 
Spiker 18. Do I have size 2 on it? You know what, Beluga, since you said it, why not? The black works for me, so I have no reason to switch it up because it was doing poorly, but why not? Uh, I had two muxins. I've never had to peel it. I'll look at my stats. I've been complaining I've not had a peel it because I've caught hundreds and hundreds, maybe even a thousand peel it by now. Uh, but no trophy. Pumpkin. Peel it. See, no trophy. Uh, I got two Muxin trophies. Yeah, two Muxins. Man, Beast is right behind. I need that trophy if I need the lead. I need to be the safe zone. It's okay, Beast. Thank you so much. You can go ahead and use that one if you want. It's on the leaderboard right now in the weekly. I'm actually just going to run into town because it's sort of slow right now. It's 2 slash 10, it's full red. Join the original chat. Uh, I like the competition chat because I just want to keep an eye on what <laughs> beast was catch. <laughs> uh, Spiker 2 dash 10. S-P-I-K-E-R. Yeah, it is slow. Alright, I will join. 50 bucks, hot damn. Inventory lures. Let me go ahead. Uh... uh Biker, let me get rid of you. Let me put with you. All right, I have a fish on. Uh, let me go to M Dog Channel. There we go. Okay. Instructions own clear hooked a wolf. Adrian, hello. You can see what he catches in the original as well. I know, I know. But it's just so many fish in the original, I prefer the chat. Right, we're gonna have to lock these reels up because I think I'll fish on all of them. I got nothing on this. Okay. Got something on this. Alright, morning's finally coming up, so, uh. We're gonna start doing some damage here. Best form bottom scale, the guy in VK max, clip with a tie rod. Nothing on this as well. Yeah, someone caught from the dock, I think, two trophy tamens. Top water wobbler. Railing. I mean, I look at the weeklies. There's no point. Uh, what is it? Arctic? Look at that. The spiker is working. Arctic railing. I'll just stick with these. I don't know which, which wobbler will.
F11 the purple. That's to try another time, I guess. Oh, wow. Uh oh. Uh oh. No. No. Bad taming. Bad taming. Bad taming. Unhook yourself right now. I have to run here. Or I'm going to get spooled. Uh, if this was not a competition, I would have alt f Ford. Good one, Beastro. Good one. For sending that... <laughs> that tame to me. How much line do I have? 215 meters of line. He is going towards the opening here. Is the way it's running. I know if it's a tame in most of the time, uh, but Pike I've learned very quickly. Blue brown, uh, highly unlikely. And he, I think even if it was a blue brown, it would not even run as close to this. This is way too powerful. Like that trophy brown, I. Reeled it in without it even taking out any line. That's how weak it is. Now it could be a trophy peeled. Or a muxon. Because even the muxon made us run. Uh, but if it is a trophy of those smaller fish. It needs to die out within the next minute or two. Because they don't last too long. Uh, Bistro still a 1.7 AG. And I'm running around hoping to unhook, but it never unhooks. When you have an actual big fish that you want, those stupid things will unhook. It's so annoying. I'll open the bale, you know, I'll close the bale. Nope, still not unhooked. Yeah, go up river. Kill yourself. Ah, uh, boy. Surprisingly, I only had one small team in yesterday in the competition. He's still at 1.7. Oh, he's gone far in. Brown trout. Okay. I got scared for a second. I thought, Beaster, you got a 3.2 kg brown trout. Because right underneath you, someone has a bream, and it's also starting with a B. So I'm like, whoa. Trophy right there. Congrats. I'm also in-game chat, Beaster. I'm not in the... Round whitefish, nice. How far in are you? Over there. <laughs> Soon. I even threw ground bait yesterday here. I knew it wasn't gonna make a difference, but I threw it anyway because I mean I have so much left over. Okay, are you running that way or are you coming to me? Let me just... This is probably a 3 kg taman. Super annoying. We still have, I believe, 15 minutes, roughly, I would say. Uh, so we still have the entire day. To catch something big, fat, juicy trophy. Brown. For yourself, Timon. I wish it was any other fish. It could either be an Arctic or a Timon. <gasps> no. 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 No way. No freaking way. Oh my god. Oh my god. I should have drank. I should have freaking 
distract. Oh my god, Beluga, you are so right. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, I should have drank uh, for the XP boost, but man. Bistro, I'm sorry, but RIP and pepperonis. <laughs> uh, there you go. Well, I just proved to everyone. Uh, you can catch a very nice brown trophy here. And not even much time, guys. Oh, whoops. I, uh, I locked my reel in for... Wow, that was insane. Wow. Look at the difference between the 3.89 kg I got and this 4 is just insane. You know what then? I'm thinking when I got that brown trophy, he was like at the shore maybe. And he just didn't get any time uh, to, to run. And there we go. 4.18 on Spiker 216. My last 3.89 kg was on the same spiker. 113, 113 is the spot if you want a trophy. I think in maybe two to four hours, you have a chance of getting a brown trout trophy here. <laughs> Thank you so much, Jess. I did not relog. I was so close to relogging. Uh, but I always, always fight. Even if it is a tainment, I will fight it. Because you never know in the end. Uh, but I was so sure it was a tainment. <laughs> Thank you. Wow. So my second most wanted trophy. Not only have I got one, but I got a second one, which outdid the first one. <laughs> uh... Look at that, spin fishing just going up. Not even asking for it. And we didn't get a level up for that trophy. No way, blue is 4.2 kg, are you serious? Are you freaking serious? That's the second fish now. That's away from blue. 4.178. Let's have a bigger look at this guy here. Oh yeah, baby. 4.178. Damn. Am I not in the weeklies? Probably am, because it just started out. Oh, it's not? Okay. 5 kg is blue. Okay, yeah. 5 kg makes sense. A whole number. River muscle. Sure. Yeah, let's check the weeklies, just, you know, why not? Look at that. Again, spin fishing went up. Uh... Sorry, blue guy, it's a joke, I know, I know. <laughs> oh my god, I destroyed the competition. 3.6 right now is the biggest. Now I know, guys, the weekly just reset. But I am in the world weeklies. Let's go to other region. Maybe there I am, probably. No, it's gonna blitz update soon. Skull pen. There you go. Skull pen. The only lure I get skull pen and uh, Siberian gudgeons on is the handmade spinner bait. I think Jessica, you've sent me this one. So thank you so much. I never had a need for it until I caught until I got to Tunguska. <laughs> so your kindness is still helping me out. Blue tag is 300 grams away. Uh, blue tag is 5 kg. Man, this competition is one-sided all of a sudden. Not a competition anymore. 
Yeah, I'm not gonna doubt you, Bistro. At the very least, I hope you get a trophy. So this red spiker still hasn't gotten us anything. Again, I'm being a little impatient. I just need to spend an hour or two minimum with it to see a difference. You never talk about my kindness. <laughs> I do. I gave you thumbs up. And I'm giving you thumbs up again, Beluga. You're so kind for giving me those dead perch. And what other life bait that you gave me? Yeah, so kind, Beluga. So kind. <laughs> That's insane, Brown. Thank you so much. <laughs> you will get a blue tie. Uh, because you're so humble. You don't want to take my... My... Uh, what do you call it? Uh, I can't remember that word. But... Not sure if this is from me. Uh, who gifted this to me then? Where is it? Of course it's not going to be here because it's on my rod. That is... Uh, let's press I. What do I have on right now? Oh, it doesn't say. I have to unequip it to see it. <laughs> so humble. You're definitely not humble at Amber when I'm there. You're savage. <laughs> How much silver does a blue spin rod cost? Ah, uh, I'm sorry, what? Blue spin rod? Here is your payback. I guess. And it sucks because you're the only one in the competition too, so it's more personal. <laughs> uh... No. I know, we're just kidding around. Luga, what's up? Yes, dead. Dead life bait. It wasn't live bait, it was dead bait. You know what? At least I do well at Tunguska. This is one place I'm happy with. I think that's another brown trout we're getting here. Nope, Arctic. The crown bait. Yeah, frogs are alive. Yeah, you know what? Thank you. But you did say you didn't need them, so it's not like you went out of your way for them. <laughs> I'm kidding, I'm kidding. Is that a brown? That is a pike. Uh, someone in the chat just got a 2.5 kg brown. So there are other people fishing for browns, I feel like, at Tunguska. I just don't know what spot they're at, if they're at 113. Raptor hook uh, spots, I told you. Yeah, but I mean, truth be told, a lot of your spots are also on the main form. Uh, but yeah, I never... Not say anything. Negative. Uh, Joan, I don't understand your question. I apologize. 1.7 kg, oh man. Easter, I really hope you get something. Oh. Ah, uh, the rods with extra bonus. Ah. Yeah, they're obviously more expensive, but I just don't know the price. Let's see how much this is. I think 1 at 77 was the 3.89 kg. Trophy oh, I really hope there's a trophy brown for cafe order. Okay, you found it? Good. Because uh, last time I got a trophy, uh, there wasn't an order, so I just 
left the fish in my bag, I logged in the next day in real life, and the order was still not there, so sadly I had to sell my fish. Yeah, I don't think the spot's doing well though today. I feel I'm doing worse than yesterday. Like if we take this trophy out, uh, I just, I don't know if, if it's good today. Blue girl, check your message. Just give me a second. Uh, the form is hard to use. I literally find the wrong spots by my own. Yeah, you do it the hard way. One point five kg muxin. They usually push the rod like this. Or two kg peel it or hopefully another two kg brown trout. Yep, two point seven kg muxin. Oh, no fish. Oh, okay. I just locked my reel and boom, a fish went for it. Yep. Luga, I never knew that. Look at that. Spin fishing went up again. Insane. But that is a very nice Arctic railing. Uh, but yeah, it's very true, Beluga. No one told me this. I found out myself here. When I press right click, the fish would still take out the line. But when I would go like this, uh, the fish couldn't take out my line and I had more, like, control over it. That's what I always do. Once the fish tires out, then I will right click it in. Bistro with a 1 kg grilling right with me over there. So that's good. That's, uh, if I remember correctly, 20 silver for just that one fish. You found that out yourself as well. Perfect. All it took me was uh, to get to Tunguska <laughs> to figure that out. 559 a gram. You know what? Weather might have played a role as well. <clears throat> but I think when I got that 3.89 kg, it was just normal, like 12 degrees or whatever weather. Five sixty-two gram grayling. Grayling looks so beautiful. Doing good all around with fish quality. That's great. Uh, Bistro, if you want to check out the 197 spot that spot is insane this spot is not close to as good as that spot i just came here to get a brown trout trophy because this is where uh you have the biggest chance but if you want to make money uh 197 is the best spot at tunguska uh, several times in one hour 20 minutes many times i've made 880 silver 800 you know 60 silver Stuff like that. It's insane. Look at that. Another skull pin on the hand made a lure. Uh, it's just a non-marker though. The 190 spot is all the way up there. I think you already know. Because I've streamed there several times. Uh, but that's my favorite spot. I even get a more catfish there at night. All right, almost it's more than six minutes left. Been there, love that spot too. Perfect bistro. <laughs> uh, 
Oh, come on. You need a bigger brown. I hope you get one. Eight ninety-four gram. Yeah, that one ninety cent spot. I've been there for two or three weeks now. Uh, that's how I made money for my second Tagara. Two point three two kg brown trout. Wow. I think temperature is playing a role here. Sorry, Bistro. I hope I can send a trophy or at least a 2kg brown towards you. <laughs> Adrian, you're too kind. Okay, so oh. a little over five minutes left here. If we go by weight, four kg brown, 2.7 mux in it. Oh wow, we have two brown trots that are two and 2.32 kt. Wow, okay. Nice view too. And you don't have those annoying uh, birds that all of a sudden loudly chirp annoyingly. What could you Atlantic salmon? That's a good size. Muxin, no thank you. Siberian Dace, look at that, another fish on the handmade lure. What I want to check is, these salmons, what did I catch them on? Spiker 16, Spiker 16, and Spiker 16. So that new Spiker uh, hasn't gotten anything big yet. Uh, I've played 12 competitions, I've only won 3. Rather slow, even at daytime. There's a fish uh, following my 
my spinner. One point eight kg brown. Yeah, we have some nice browns coming out. Spin again went up. That's just insane. Come on. Never been this low. Uh, Bistro, I uh, improved my best brown in the competition. Oh, you, you improved it. Nice. 2.29. Wow. Nice work. I'm pretty sure had I not gotten that trophy, you would be in the lead now. That's great. 2.29 at 3 kg. That is a very good effort. Oh. Probably a 2kg muxin. Now bending my, my head all the way to the sky. Very flexible body we have in this game. There we go, we can right click now. What do we have? Muxen? Elid? Come on, come on, come on. Anticipation is killing me. Not right clicking. Aw, oh, pike. Yuck. That is still a very valiant effort, Bistro. Pumpkin sunfish. Nice. Hopefully next weekend when I stream, guys, uh, donuts has good weather all week on that day because sadly I was so happy to go there but it's just too warm Siberian roach wow 236 gram Siberian roach. 
What is a Siberian roach? There's Cisco. Uh, Siberian. Sculpin. Ah, Siberian roach. This thing. This is not common at all as well. Nice work. Master of the Roaches. <laughs> they call you Papa Roach. Needed a fish to level up from 29 to 30 back in the day. I was fishing for Eastern Bream. Eastern Breams are worth a lot of XP. They are rare fish too, so to find a Eastern Bream spot is insane. Muxin, weird looking fish. Yeah, I would just go to Wolkov, I think. That's the only place I knew. To level up quick. And for money as well. Until I got to Tunguska. Like, you can use ultralight setup here, and man, you can just kill it. That's what I love about this. You need light leaders, light gear, so even if you wear them out they're like nine is silver to replace like the leader or the line is you know it's so cheap and you're also not sp uh, spending a lot of uh energy using heavier rods and, and stuff so really nice ah damn it Level of fish is common, Roach. <laughs> yeah, you know what? Even for this weather, it's sort of slow here. Only 43 fish, and that is with our other fishing adventure in one hour, which is uh, it's pretty bad. Okay, 1.1 kg pink salmon, that's 20 to 30 silver right there. Okay, Arctic grilling. I think at 197 spot, you are bound to get more 1kg plus pink salmons there. I wonder if uh, we had a better chance of getting a trophy pink salmon at that 197 spot today in this cold weather. But I feel a trolling gives you a higher chance though. For a pink. What's the temperature like? It's going back to normal, 14 degrees. Oh wow, uh, 15 seconds left. Thereabouts. So yeah, sadly, slow fishing, but you know what? Some good quality fish here. 2.3 kg brown by Mr. Bistro. Alright, alright, calm down. Alright, so, uh, wow. 
for KT Brown Trout, we broke our own personal record. Uh, Mr. Bistro there. Only because of this one Brown Trout you lost or else you would have clearly been the winner. 2.29 kg is a very nice size Brown Trout. Thank you so much Bistro for being a part of this competition when no one else was around. And let's go ahead and check the cafe. I really hope there is an order for Trophy Brown. Oh, damn it. Nothing. Absolutely nothing. Oh, man. This sucks. What should I do? I guess I'm going to keep that Trophy Trout. I'm going to come in a, like an hour and a half or two hours. 50 marker of fish in one hour. So you did better than me. Yeah, check how much silver that is. I did bad. Actually. At 197 in one hour, uh, I would have like probably 80 fish markers. So. Price. 188 silver for that brown. 34 silver for 2.32 kg brown. See, that's bad price. That's an amazing size for a brown, but that price is so low. Compared to other fish. Pink. Look at that. 1.1 kg pink is 31 silver. Arctic railing 1.1 kg is 31 silver. Uh, Very well priced. What I'm going to do is... Let's check how much we made. 673. Remember guys, I did catch a few worthless fish. When I was fishing for the uh, epic win. Thank you. Thank you, Jess. Excluding this, we made 483 silver. That's not too great. Uh, what I'm going to do is... Two, two, one point three. Still all these fish. Now, usually at Tunguska, there will be an order. I think it says 1.7 kg brown trouts or bigger. Three of them for 177 silver. Uh, maybe I can do that order. Hopefully, when I come back, I can catch another one. And hopefully, maybe there's a brown trout order for a trophy. So, thank you, Jess. Uh, where did you get the brown trout trophy? 113. 113. Tongue, obviously. Let's see what uh, Bistro has. And I think that is going to be it. Uh, I can try for Sterlitz, but honestly, I don't know. Sterlitz is such a slow business. 553 silver. Okay, that's decent. Far better than what I did. Look at this line. I think I'm just going to conclude it here, guys. Uh, no reason to go further. I'm not even sure what to do in this game anymore. Uh, I can go to that 197 spot because I don't have much time. I'm going to come tonight later on and probably go Sterlet Sturge fishing here at Tunguska. Try my luck again. But uh, not enough time for stream. So I just wanted to say thank you so much everyone for being a part of the stream, for being a part of the chat, for the competition, Bistro. Thank you all. I hope to see you guys tomorrow and day after. The Fisher Online tomorrow, Bass Pro Shop fishing a sim day after tomorrow. And I'll leave you with this beautiful view. I hope you all have a great rest. Hope you have a great rest of the day. Hope you have a great Monday. And I'll see you all tomorrow hopefully.
Uh, until the next time, guys, enjoy and have a good one.